because they were out there stroking them. Me and Mum were watching. <laughs> no, I'm not. Yo, 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 it's your girl Azara. Welcome back to our channel. Hi, guys. Welcome back to our channel. Um, we're on our second trip now. To the tip to the tip and we've only got bits and bobs which what, what I call bits and bobs is you know like the boxes the yeah, lawn mowers just, and just the boxes stuff like that and then wood. bits and pieces of wood and an old laundry basket so we're doing that and then we're going to pop to I think maybe B&M is it B&M that do like little stall things no Didn't, it weren't B&M it was the range yeah it was the range that we saw some in was it was yeah. that that was more dearer though wasn't it yeah but they used to do them in hair bargains but they don't anymore Look, okay. we actually wear makeup. Yeah. We've actually made an effort to Yeah, I actually, well, Lazara put conditioner all in my hair, so I'm trying to sort it out. Try and sort us out, out bit by bit, guys. So we're going to take you on our journey down to the tip, tip as usual. Yeah. I'm roasting. Second trip to the tip in two days. Isn't it nice? The sun's actually out, my dear. It's roasting. Oh, I feel that fresh air coming on my face. Guys went into Dunham. Is that what it's called? Yeah, Dunham. It's, it's called Dunham. Dunham. Yeah, Dunham. Dunham. Well, one of them. Dunham. And um, Dun -dun -dun. Wanted, <laughs> wanted a little ottoman at the side of my couch. So storage could, one. Yeah, a little storage one. But couldn't find it. So now we're it. now we're going to the range. So hi guys, right? Um, so I'm going to go now to the range and see if I can get a little one from there. Will we go to our one or no? You have to go I to think the it'll big, be the big one, one, yeah. Just look at I've got a little storage thing and there's not wires and you know stuff all over and you can see them as clear as anything. And then the books keep falling on the floor and yes, that's what we need. An ottoman. Yeah. As far as do we need anything else? Is that everything? Didn't think you wanted anything else. You anything? said do we need one then like for your flowers? What are they called? Hose oh, you said things. a hose pipe. We bought, the we range. bought the, the hose thing for the flowers, didn't we? Yeah, we did. It's an attachment you put onto the end of your hose pipe. Oh well, we don't need that then. That's everything. Yeah, I don't think we need anything else. We just need your little things you can hide. I need a radiator off. cover. My bedroom, bedroom's quite a large one, so we're doing that. Yeah, because it looks nice covering your radiator. Yeah, it looks nice and clean and modern. Hmm. It's 27 degrees. It's beautiful. This is the weather you want. Literally. Oh gosh. So you'll see us at the range, guys. Or at the range. See it at the big range. Mum's letting me know my keys were falling out of my pocket. <laughs> yeah, have a think about dropping keys. Oh my gosh. We're in the range and we're busy looking around, but there's loads of little sales on. And I found one that I like. I'll sort of show you. It's like that. So I've got hold of it. I'll show you better when we get home. But it's like little sales on everywhere. It's a laundry basket. Look, it's even got a teddy on it. Look. They're all right for kids' rooms, aren't they? Nice, that's what I wanted to As you just heard, that was Dribble meowing from the window. Oh, I'll show you where. <laughs> you ready? Oh no. Oh no, the drill. The meow equals treats. We're back home now from being at Sainsbury's. I'll show you how I make my spaghetti bolognese. So, you can see I've got my mushrooms, I've got a salary, I've got garlic, I've got a carrot. I usually get 5% mince, but they didn't have it, so I had to get 10%. I've got some tomatoes, I've got some basil, and because I'm also making a lasagna, because it's only just for me and my mum, I'll use half of it for lasagna, half Spaghetti 
Thanks, I'll choose you. Fed by all the neighbours down the street. Because they were out there stroking them, me and Mum were watching. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> yeah, so what happened yesterday, Mum? They said don't feed cats. No, <laughs> they definitely didn't. Yeah, so yesterday we were standing outside because I was giving the neighbours some. Like, because we were clearing out the shed, we had some bits and bobs that we didn't need. And I always asked the neighbours, do you want it first? And um, she said that her cousin had just moved into a flat and she needed a few things so I was letting her look through what we were getting rid of and um, we seen Kitty Corn which is a stray cat and then we seen the neighbour say she just fed her so I was like okay the neighbour's just fed her and then we seen this I think it was mother and daughter that lived down the bottom of our street they came up to her and they started stroking her and we were like she doesn't need to do that random people stroke her. It took us ages to get her to let her stroke her. So we watched and then they said, is this your cat? Because we were watching and we were like, no, that ain't our cat, she's a stray. We sometimes feed, but we feed her every day, twice a day. And then um, she says, oh, um, oh, that's all right then, because we feed her. And me and mum were like, she's a crafty little thing. She's getting everyone to feed her, kitty. Me, yeah, she's a stray that's literally playing the system. She's going around to us all, looking us in the eyes like, I don't, I don't get fed. She's such a pretty cat. And she just meows. She sits there going, meow. So that's the mushrooms, that's the celery and the carrot. Mr. Twix. I'll work it all in. So you can see there's a lot of veg there. Yeah, so just normal vegetable oil. I'll use the tiniest amount. As you can see. Yeah? And then I'd have the rest of the time with straight. But then I went for a bit where I just didn't want it curly. And then I, I figured out that my hair wasn't curling as much. It was going more frizzy. So now I've just been leaving deep conditioner in and trying to get my curls back. That's Carlos and Kira home. Yeah. 
Hello. I'm sorted the hose out. So she's uh, more in the pants. Is that Kitty this time? Dribble. Kitty. What's Kitty now? So you just seen that Dribble was there. Dribble was there. Now Kitty. Into little bits. <laughs> yeah, we do. Yeah. I do yeah. like to buy my yeah. tomatoes. Okay, I'll leave that to cook for a minute. I was showing you the evidence that I buy chopped tomatoes. Was he actually? Yeah, yeah I didn't show him anything. He did, he showed you the evidence. Okay, I put my basil on it. I put quite a lot on. It's got like a bit of basil. A bit more about a quarter. A quarter. A quarter. I'm going to just break it all apart. I've got two choices. I can do it in this one, or I can do it in that one. That one's deeper. I'm going to do it in my deeper one. The washing machine done now, so you won't hear that anymore. So, it's getting brown now. is I take the puree and give it a good squeeze. That off. There we go. And I take this. Put it in. And fill it up with water. Mr. Dribble. And I put the water on the side and I just mix it. In. Get the water and I put the whole lot in. I'm now making the lasagna. So now I'm just adding my bolognese to this. So I felt like I was going to then. You see it? Like that. Yeah. Then I add the lasagna layer. Want to tell everyone how it smells? It smells amazing. I take the sheet up, smells okay, and I put it in. And then what I do with the next bit is to have a little bit of a gap. Or just break it a little bit. Add it to where the gap is. Add a bit more of my, my bolognese. Roast them. So I'm just adding it to the top. I hope you can see that another layer. See how much my spaghetti bolognese is left? There's loads.